we now discuss the solution of a problem that appeared in the joint entrance examination main held on 27th june 2022 in the second shift this given problem is on the probability as a proportion of areas and the question is from the section statistics and probability the given question is if a point a with coordinates x comma y lies in the region bounded by the y axis straight lines 2y plus x is equal to 6 and 5x minus 6y is equal to 30 then the probability that y less than 1 is we are given four options option a 1 by 6 option b 5 by 6 option c 2 by 3 option d 6 by 7 so we have y axis and two straight lines 2y plus x is equal to 6 and 5x minus 6y is equal to 30 and uh, the point a with coordinates x comma y lies in the region bounded by this y axis and two straight lines then we have to find the probability that uh, the point a of x comma y when y less than 1 is so we have to find the probability that a point a of x comma y when y less than 1 is the one required to find now before entering into the discussion of the problem let us note down the probability as a proportion of geometric areas it is done like this if a point a with coordinates x comma y is equally likely to be anywhere in a given region r that means the point a with coordinates x comma y is any point in the given region r with area a suffix r then the probability p of the point a with coordinates x comma y is in a particular sub region r prime of r the probability p of the point this point a x comma y is in a particular sub region r prime of r with area a suffix r prime and then the probability p is given by p is equal to a suffix the area of the sub region r prime by the area of the region r so that's the probability now let's get into the question and solve the right that's the given question to us we now discuss the solution of the problem in detail we have two straight lines call them as l1 and l2 where l1 is 2y plus x is equal to 6 and l2 is 5x minus 6y is equal to 30 and y axis so this is x axis y axis and the origin o now l1 and l2 intersect y axis at a point say p with coordinates 0 comma 3 the point say q with coordinates 0 comma minus 5 respectively now let's see let's get into the l1 right and uh, y axis 
so l1 and l2 intersect the y axis so y axis means put x is equal to 0 in this then you will get 2y is equal to 6 y is equal to 3 that means at a point p 0 comma 3 in l2 put x is equal to 0 Then you will get minus six y is equal to thirty. That is y is equal to minus five. That means uh, L two cuts the y axis at a point say Q with coordinates zero comma minus five. Let's get into L one. Yes, L one is here. L one. It intersects the y axis at zero comma three, and L two intersects the y axis. At zero comma minus five. Further, L one and L two intersect at a point say R. Take this L one and L two solve. And I have not shown the how to solve and all that. You are very familiar how to solve two equations in two unknowns. Do it. And the point of intersection of L one and L two is six comma zero. Let's call that as the point R. L1 and L2 intersect at R, six comma zero. That means on the x-axis. Agreed. Let R be the region bounded by the y-axis L2 and L1. So the shaded region R is shown here. The light. Uh, yellow color we have shaded that is the region r that is r is the triangle pqr agreed given the point a with coordinates x comma y is any point in the region r therefore we compute the area of the region r a suffix r And how do we get the area? That is the area of the triangle PQR. For the triangle PQR, take PQ as the base, and the height is OR. So half into PQ into OR. So half into PQ into OR. Now how much is PQ? This is three units. This is three units. These are five units. Five plus three, eight. So PQ is eight units multiplied by, and uh, R is uh, origin is zero comma zero, R is six comma zero. So the R will be the x coordinate of R minus the x coordinates of zero. That is six minus zero is six. So one by two into eight into six, eight six are forty eight by two. That is equal to twenty four. So the area of the region R we got. agreed let's get into the next slide so that is the figure so far that's what we have done here now the line y is equal to 1 intersects l1 now get into l1 put y is equal to 1 so then you will get 2 plus x is equal to 6 that is x is equal to 4 that means y is equal to 1 intersects the line l1 at a point s with coordinates 4 comma 1 and y is equal to 1 intersects y axis obviously at 0 comma 1 let's call this as t so here is the line yes y is equal to 1 it intersects l1 at s with coordinates 4 comma 1 intersects y axis at t that is 0 comma 1 Now, why are we considering? Why are we considering y is equal to one? We have to, we have to, you know, talk about all those points A with coordinates x comma y of the region R when y less than one. We have to consider. Then we talk about the probability of such points. Required to find the probability p of the point. A with coordinates x comma y, y less than one, of the region R, of the region R. 
So it is of the region or means it is a sub region. So that is all those points in a particular sub region R prime of R. R prime is a part of R where R prime is bounded by y axis L2, L1 and y is equal to 1. It is y axis bounded by y axis L2, L1 and y is equal to 1. So note that R prime is the quadrilateral Q, R, S, T and this is the shaded portion. This is the, the shaded portion Q R S T is this one. This one in uh, light uh, pink color. Agreed. Now we want to find uh, the area of R prime. A suffix R prime that is called area of the subregion R prime. That is called area of the quadrilateral Q R S T. And uh, we will find the area of the quadrilateral Q R S T as uh, the area of the triangle P Q R minus the area of this uh, small triangle which is in yellow, light yellow. That is uh, P T S. So the area of the triangle P Q R minus the area of the triangle P T S. So the area of triangle P Q R minus area of triangle P T S. The area of triangle P Q R we have already calculated that is A R that is 24 minus 1 by 2 into is a triangle. It is a triangle 1 by 2 into base. Base is base is T S. Base is T S multiplied by the height is P T. And 24 minus 1 by 2 into base T S is the the x coordinate of s minus the x coordinate of t that is 4 minus 0 is 4 and p t p t is uh, the y coordinate of p minus the y coordinate of t that is 3 minus 1 2 so 1 by 2 into 4 into 2 and that uh, 2 to cancels 24 minus 4 is 20 now the required probability P is equal to AR prime by AR. The area of R prime by the area of R that is 20 by 24 that is equal to that is equal to 5 by 6. Let us look at the options here and our answer 5 by 6 appears against option B. Therefore, the answer to this question is option B and that is the detailed discussion of the solution of a problem which is based on the computing of probability as a proportion of areas from the section probability statistics and probability and it is definitely an interesting question. I am sure that you have understood the solution of this problem and I wish you all the best. Thank you.